You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! What's Gucci? What's shaking? It's ass cash. Shake a lot, man. You already know what it is, man. Punch lines in politics, man. Shotgun shook, man. <laughs> nah, you already know what it is, man. It's your boy Charlie Clips. Harlem, we in the building. Punch lines in politics. 15 minutes of fame. <clears throat> What's up? You got a question for Charlie? Yeah, I got a question for Charlie. Yo, what's I, good, I what's good boy? Hello? Yo, what up, family? What's good? What's going on, Clips? What's up with you, my guy? Ain't, ain't shit, brother. I'm up here chilling, enjoying life, man. Life is great. What's good with you? Everything good? Yeah, man, you just got me a little fucked up. I mean, I make out with the devil. I look like brother and sister, but um, <laughs> sorry, <about> that, man. <laughs> ah, my nigga. Like, <laughs> yeah. Yo, um, I was wondering, man, where you get all your references and shit from, man? Like, all the jokes and shit, man. Like, you read a lot? Like, where you get it from? Oh, um, man, that came from a, that came from a lot of TV, man. When I tell you a lot of TV, a lot of TV. Just being in the crib when I was young and shit, my mom's wasn't letting me out the house and shit like that. So, nigga, I had to watch everything that Family Matters, He Man, nigga, Thundercats, nigga. I just, re- <laughs> I just remember everything. So when it come to joking and snapping, and I go, you look like. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then you know, I started combining niggas together and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Um, you look like X Factor McCody and shit or something like that, I'll say. You know what I'm saying? And just combine both niggas and do shit like that. You know, that that's where the rap inside kicking that, man. But, um, you know, being in the crib all the goddamn time until I was like, 18, 17, 18, nigga. I, I was in the house every day just watching movies, man, TV galore. So that's where all that shit came from. And then being from Harlem, my nigga. All we, all them niggas only, only, well, everybody snap everywhere you go because I found out, um, you know, that, um, how niggas in Atlanta snap. I just seen how they snap, how they get down, boy. They get down crazy too. So, you know, it's not just Harlem, but being in Harlem, you got to have jokes every day. And being a fat nigga growing up, you had to have those, man. So that's where it all came from. Okay, man. Respect that, man. Yeah, I was wondering, man. I'm trying to get to get together like you, man. Nah, you start. Nah, out, you you start. You started off. You started off fire with the brother and sister joke and shit. You know what I'm saying? You started off funny, so nigga, it, it sounds like it's there. Right, all right, man. All right, Clips. I ain't gonna hold y'all up, man. I'm gonna keep watching, man. Keep watching your moves and everything you doing. Yo, I appreciate you, brother. My nigga, good looking boy. All right, Clips. Stay up, stay up, man. <laughs> Punchlines and politics. Talk to me, nice. Ash. You know, this is Sean calling from D.C. Where's Charlie? He's here, LaShawn. Oh, this is the girl I was telling you about, man. Oh, LaShawn, what's up, baby? Okay, Charlie, let me say something. I got to be cool because I'm watching church. I'm watching Mary Mary. But um, you don't need to come to D.C., boo-boo. What's, what he got to come to D.C. <laughs> for? Because, you know, I used to come to New York a long time ago, but that was in my traveling days. I, you could come here. I, 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 I come I come to DC. What, what are we gonna do? Oh well, you know what? Let's not discuss that on the air. <laughs> hey, I already hit your inbox, baby. Just check that on your uh, Instagram. But um, I also want to say I love that song. Love is a battlefield. You took that that dinner song. That was nice. Oh, oh, thank you. I appreciate that. You know, I was just trying to, you know, talk about my life and relationships and stuff, and you know how you care about people and. They always think you're doing something that you're not. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully when I make a song about you, it'll be all love, baby. Oh, baby, you you have to write a book. But yeah, go check that deal and hit me back. I'm out. All right, I got you. I got you. <laughs> all right. Bye, LaShawn. Bye. Bye, love. DC going to stand for damn, Charlie. <laughs> DC going to stand for dick, dick, dick. <laughs> dick coming. <laughs> Yo. Punchlines and politics. Talk to me nice. Yeah, I'm trying to talk to the clip. Yo, what's up? What's up, boy? What's good, my nigga? What's good, Chris? Man, this is Earl from out of Baltimore down here in Baltimore, man. I need to ask you a question, Earl, though. Uh-uh. We don't talk to people named Earl. Oh, <laughs> uh, come on, man. <laughs> you, you, you know why? Yo, you know why she don't talk to Earl? You t- got to check her battle. You she talk, talk to, to Earl, too. She talk to Earl all the time in her no, battle. No, you talk to... You the one who gave me Earl. <laughs> What's up, my nigga? Talk to me, man. I'm taking over this show, man. Talk to me. <laughs> yeah, man. Hey, is you still cool with Rock since he threw that shot at your brother on, on talking all crazy on uh, you know YouTube and stuff? Oh, hell yeah, nigga. Me and Tay Rock is super cool, man. Me and, me and, um, me and Rock... 
talk all the time and shit. We actually were supposed to get up in New York. I was out of town. I had to go to L.A., but we were supposed to get up and work on some music and stuff. So, man, Rock is cool. Rock, you talking about when Rock said about DNA, right? Yeah. Nah, DNA and Rock is super cool and shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, they got wow. the battle. They got the battle coming up and shit. But, nigga, I, I, I be and be more here and there. You know what I'm saying? Whenever I come, I try to hit Rock up. So, I, that's my nigga right there. You know, Rock is, is like one of the niggas I'm super proud of from where we first started at and when I gave him the rematch. And now where he's at in his career with everybody wanting to battle him. So, you know, I got genuine love from Rock just because, you know, it's like our careers come, you know, me battling him is what made my career just as well. So I always have oh, genuine cool. love for Rock. You know what I'm saying? That's my nigga. Yeah, yeah. He, I mean, I ain't never met the dude. I was saying, you know, what I mean? like as far as I ain't never met you either. So I'll be, I'll be, you know, I'll be a pause and be happy to meet you if I ever see you come to be more. You know. All right. Well, but, uh, what I be I, doing like, sometimes? Follow me on Instagram if you're not already or Twitter. Um, when I be going places, I be announcing I'm out there. So if you ever see or whatever, you know, what I'm saying. Hopefully, I hit the mall up or something. Just have people meet me in the mall. We we all get up, take some pictures, laugh and joke and like shit. You, you already know the mall down here. It's called Mall Diamond, brother. You already know, my nigga. So just follow me, and you'll see when I post that. You definitely when you. When you um when we speak and shit, just remind me that it's you from the radio station, from Punchlines and Politics and shit. I definitely remember. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I hit, yeah, I hit your Twitter early today. You know I mean, I've been hit you. I got your uh, Instagram and all that. Yeah, all right, yeah, my, my, my nigga, it. my nigga. I appreciate you, bro. Good looking, man. Appreciate the love. No Thank doubt, you for doubt, calling. Man. There's, no, there's no doubt, man. That's why I say I tell people all the time. I said, you know, Clips is one of them dudes. that's hard to beat. You know what I mean? And, and, and the reason why you do be killing niggas because you sit there and you listen, man, and you and you rebuttal that stuff against them, and, and you just, you just the king of that shit. So it's, it's not too many niggas that can come across you. Now, one more thing before we leave. Yeah. The reason why I say Rock lost both times is because Rock is cool, but he got too many gun balls. His whole rap is nothing about a gun. You, you talk to him. You came straight out right. and you talked to him, so you beat him. You beat him straight up. I, and I told I told Queen that too when I was hanging with his Queen not too long ago. I said I said Clips beat Rock both times, especially the second time. Right, he right, my nigga. Hey. You already know him being from B more and shit. I appreciate that, my nigga. That's that's true exactly, story. That's my real man, shit. Exactly. You keep doing that good work, and I hope to see you when you down here, Clips. I right, bet. Just holler at me, bro. I'm gonna see you for sure. We gonna bump into each other in life for sure. All right, my nigga. All right. All right. All right. We gonna go to this next caller. They called like twelve times. Oh yeah. Let's let's get them on the line. Love. Yeah. Punchlines of politics, talk to me nice. Hey, what's good, Ash Cash? Charlie, what's still up there? Yo, what's up, boy? What up, my nigga? What's, what's good, what's good, what's good, nigga? It's T, I'm out of Tennessee, man. I'm out of chat town. Tennessee, out of Tennessee, you already know what's up with you, my nigga. What's good? I just got a question, man. Yeah. Uh, for real, like, what you feel about, like, the KOTD situation, like, where the y'all artists, like, I ain't want to call y'all URL artists, but right, right. y'all coming up there, like, not being able to like come for the chain, you know what I'm saying? Like y'all put in work and shit. Hold right. On. <laughs> My fault. Yo, that's a, like yo, you DNA. That's a great question. You know what I'm saying? Like I I, I be putting my own niggas on this shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm from down south. Right, right. I've been on y'all. But like, what you feel about that though? Nah, you know what I'm saying? That's, like, a, great, that's a great question. <laughs> uh, first off, shout out to Canada. Shout out to King of the Dot. Them are my niggas over there. It's always right, 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 organic. Right. First and foremost. I'll focus too. Yeah. Um, the thing is this. Um. You know, business is business, and I always look at it as marketing. Um, you know, when you think about it, right, like I always felt like DNA deserved a shot at the chain more than anybody. I felt Hell like, yeah. I felt like him, and, him yeah. and Diz got the most views, I believe, in King of the Dot history. What they battled was like to hit four million or something like that. DNA went over there, you know, and enslaved and, and put in that work. Over there right. and, and was going hard at niggas, it, you know, the drop of a dime, you call him, he's there. So I felt like DNA deserved the title shot. Um, I felt like me and Sharon battle was probably like one, they probably wanted to see who was going to do what. So I feel like I was responsible for Pat State and yeah, Sharon because, yeah. you know, I didn't, being that I didn't really, you know, do, um, go in there against Sharon and I tried to get out the battle, but they wouldn't let me back out, you know what I mean? Right, so right, so it right, was what right. it was, but I felt like that's how that battle came about. But I felt like it should have always been DNA there anyway instead of me or even having a chance to get a title shot. Now, me and Sharon didn't, they didn't say whoever win this battle goes for the chain, but, you know, I kind of knew probably what it, what it was or what it felt like, but DNA, out of all rappers, 
battle rapper should be the one to get a shot at that chain. And if him and Rome got to go at it the third time, I think he deserves it more than anybody. You know what I'm saying? And I look at it like this. It, like you said, you don't want to call us URL rappers, but that's what we right. get called anyway. I'm independent. Right. I do what that's I want. Mecca, man. Like, get where y'all live in New York. Like, yeah. That's Mecca, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I, I, I do what I want, so I'm not a URL rapper, but if you were to describe my style and where I'm from, then you would call me that. So I look at it like Roan, Immaculate, Pat Stay, um, all the people that held the chain are King of the Dot-based MCs. So my thing is... That's who you kind of want to have the chain anyway. Somebody who's not going to probably always ask for a significant amount of money and who's going to be right, over there okay. to hold it down every time. So I don't blame King of the Dot for always putting their MCs in a situation to get the chain because we just right. like going there and whipping ass and coming back to America. So right. that's what we like to do. But I do think DNA deserves a shot at that title. Right. All right, that that that's what's up. But I'm off. I'm gonna get one more in, Ashley. I'm sorry, baby. Please. Like, <laughs> this like, this, this is my show. This is my show. Yeah, Do your thing, bro. Love. It's Ask Charlie okay, segment. What, okay, okay. What you think? Okay, like the, I've been I've been on Bad Rap for for like years, for about like four five years now, following y'all. Yeah. And like I noticed like the crowds and stuff. Like I ain't gonna no fun. Like the crowds be running battles, man. Like crazy. Like I know we need them because the money and shit. But yeah. like they really be like they they fuck them up so bad. Like KLT, they got some good crowd. Like, but you are, they don't even give niggas chances sometimes. Like, you come in already losing. Like, right. I don't like that. Like, I watch, I don't you, know, you, man. You know, like, what it is? you know what it is? I tell people, um, when you go to a battle live, it's the energy, man. Like, you, you, it's you, the better, right? The wrong, yeah, I, I hear, like, yeah, it's always when, uh, better live. Yeah, I hear when, that when, all when, the when time. people, when people watch it, you never get the same results as you do live. Right, it's, the it's, sound it should be edited. It's right, right. It's not the same at all. You know what I mean? So what I tell people is that, yeah, I know they feel like the crowd ruined the battle sometimes. Like, I watch these small room battles, and these niggas keep going, ooh, fuck them up, talk yeah. that, this, that, and the third shit, and be throwing the battles off to me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, but I understand being there and the aura and the feel, you're not thinking about the camera. You get what I'm saying? Okay. Like you don't, yeah, you, you're yeah. not thinking about the camera. You're just so in tune with the battle that you're saying whatever comes to your mind because the energy that's in the room. You're just saying whatever, and, and unfortunately, the camera picks up everything pretty much. You know what I'm saying? That 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 okay. you know. So the noise from the crowd, the crowd talking or going over talking over niggas or booing. You know what I'm saying? So one day come yeah. to a live event and then get your study on and see the difference. You know what I'm saying? Right. If you could, you know, I know you all the way down south, but if we throw right, something. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm trying to do my research. I know more than a lot of niggas. Like, I'm telling you. Oh, no, I, I can hear it. I can scenes. hear it. I, I, the I know the questions you're really asking is good no, questions. I ain't going to do all that on here, but trust nah, the me, questions you, the questions you asking are great questions, my nigga. Like, they yeah. great, so I know you got your shit, you know what I mean, down pat. I appreciate yeah. you, my nigga. Hopefully, the, you know, the crowd appreciate don't ruin, you, you know what I mean, none of these future battles coming up, man. But I love the crowd, and I understand how it is watching it at home, though, too. You know what I'm right. saying? So, man, you know what I'm saying? You and Jazz, like, y'all niggas do y'all thing. You know what I'm saying? I Tennessee. I'm on my top. <laughs> my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate it, man. Stay up, brother. All right. All right. All right. Appreciate it, Ash. All right. No worries. All right. Yo, Punchlines of Politics. Talk to me nice. Yo, what's good? Where Charlie at? Yo, what up, boy? What's good? What's good, bro? I'm calling from the Bay Area, brother. Tell you, fuck with you. Nah, my nigga, you, you already know, man. When I come out there, it ain't nothing but love when I'm on the West Coast, man. I appreciate it out there, my nigga. Word. Yeah, but, hey, bro, what, real, real shit. Who you got next, bro? Who do you want? Fuck these other battles and shit. Who you want, bro? Um, it's only, it's only probably two battles left for me. Um, I know Ash was telling me earlier how this calling me out as he always does and then you know I, I think you know if that battle was to go down it would have to be like I would do it in Cali or something like that I'm not really pressed for that but that's one that could happen but um in terms of who I want it's really nobody that that I want per se I, I just want somebody to call me out and say something like they can kill me to talk crazy to me because I need the motivation to get amped for it really but it's nobody that I really want you know at this point in my career going against Lux going against Hollows giving other dudes shots going against the biggest names the smallest names it's pretty much you know what I'm saying I don't really know at this point I, I hope somebody you know Diz 
you know, from what Ash saying with the tweets is calling me out and he always saying something on Twitter, this, that, and the third. That might be when I'm getting interested in now getting me a little riled up because he's talking crazy. So if that's one, if he keeps talking and that comes about, then you will see me in a different form like that. Oh, Charlie wanted that one, but I'm not really pressed for it. But, you know, you got Calico is out there. I don't know. How would you feel about that? You you would fuck with that or, or nah? Uh, well, Cal, he he's sleeping right now. He ain't out there. He ain't active. But uh, that that'd be cool. That'd be cool. I want to see you a move though, bro. That should be crazy. Yeah, I, I, I'm, glad glad you, I'm glad you. I'm glad you. I'm glad you said that. I, I really don't. I try not to say his name because he mentions me on interviews left and right. Yeah. And, and and every time it's always ducking and running, and I don't got time to do that. I'm too fat to be chasing niggas. I, I ain't gonna duck and, and run and chase niggas all day. So my thing is, you know, it is what it is. You know what I mean? He wanted to move around and go at surf or whatever. That's a battle I definitely wanted to see. But I'm just chilling. You know what I'm saying? Um, if it come about, it come about. You you know what I'm saying? But it, but it's there. But if it happens, it happens. But that's a battle I would definitely be interested in if it came about, though. But I'm not going to chase it or pursue it. I'll just wait and see if it happens. But that's definitely one that would be dope, though. But that's the only two, really. It's probably like Calico and Mook, really. You know what I'm saying? That's about, that's about it for me. Yeah, those are the only ones we're waiting on, bro. That's all we want to know. You feel me? My nigga, yeah, I already know. Hopefully that do go down, though, and you're able to come through and shit and enjoy yourself. Bro, I'm probably not coming to the Gnome 6 or um, Summer Magic 6, bro, from the base, you know what I'm saying? All right, so when, you see, me, when you see me, remind me that you called up on Punchlines and Politics, my nigga, you from the base, so I can remember, and we'll chop it up at the event. That's love, bro. Good shit, bro. Hey, keep doing your thing, bro. We out, out here, we fucking with you, bro. Nothing, bro. My nigga, I appreciate you, man. Next time, I'll I post when I'm out there, too, so you can come to wherever I'm at. We get up and chop it up. 100, bro. Stay up, bro. Hi, Ash you fine too, just so you know. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> punch lines of politics. Talk to me nice. Oh, you see again. Ooh, you breaking up. Um, hey, 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 Chris, will you, uh, will you, will you ever give us, uh, uh Chilla the uh, rematch? I know you're having some voice issues and shit. That oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, that's out. a good, that's a good ass question. I'll re, I'll re, I'll rematch Chilla. I would I would rematch Chiller on a I mean, strip. I know I know you're on the right path now. You know what I'm saying? Get yeah, back popping yeah. again. You know I mean I know you battled everywhere else. And yeah, you back on your URL. So yeah. Now I would um I would re that. I would rematch Chiller yeah. again. But if me and Chiller rematch, it it can't be at no big venue. It got to be small room type shit. I want to okay, give it that feel. feel that. I want to give it that. that. I want to give it that feel. Old school feel one time, you know what I'm saying? So, um, right. that might be something that me, and, me and him might consider doing because I know, you know, the situation, you know, what I'm saying happened, you know. And the funny part about it is, yeah. even with my voice like that, I was winning. That's the most hilarious part about it. Mm, that, 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 this footage never drops on even. No, no, nah, nah, you don't know that though. It's behind the scenes, man. He know what's up, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah. but, 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 I would do it. I would do that battle again. That might be right. something I might do for my channel. So be on the lookout for that. I might Ooh, give Chilla $40 okay. and do it. Okay, I know you're talking about it. I'm going to let you get up out of here. Hey, Mook, stop ducking. Stop Talk to ducking. him. Talk to him. <laughs> <laughs> My nigga. <laughs> All right, bro. All right. Love, bro. Love it. Appreciate it, Ash. See you No worries. Shut up. Punchlines of politics. Talk to me nice. Yo. Yo. Yo, yo, of course. Yo, I called just to say... Yeah, when you when you get back on this YouTube channel, you gotta start the Reach Files, my nigga. Oh, oh yo, hilarious. Yo, the Reach Files went pl double platinum, my nigga. You know what? You're absolutely right. I had a crazy idea, but that never got back to me. I'm gonna see something again. If I could get this idea one time, it's it's gonna be even crazier than the first one. I promise you that, my nigga. It's gonna be crazy. That's what's up, man. Uh, Yo, if I can ask you one question. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Nah, my nigga, go ahead. Yo, I, I feel like, I feel like your one-rounders be like your best performances, my nigga. Like, 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 like do you feel like it, it's just easier for you to come with one fire, like long fire <laughs> round other than like three solid? Um, you know what it is? In a, in a three rounder, everything is more strategic. You gotta you gotta um, pretty much break everything up into threes. You get what I'm saying? So 
it, it depends on what somebody said, and you get a chance to rebuttal. It might not be a good time to rebuttal, but you thought it was. Then after the battle, you're like, oh, I shouldn't have rebuttal that or this, that, and the third. And a one-rounder is straightforward. You don't break nothing up. Everything is just one go. You get what I'm saying? One go. Like, you don't break anything up. So what happens when you go to do that is that when you're on fire, it's like a constant go. The whole time, you know, now imagine being on fire in a round and then the round got to get cut short because it's three rounds. So you got to stop this round, stop that round. But in a one rounder, you got your whole four to five minutes already just mapped out and it's just one go. So that's 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 what it be. It just be when you start and you zone it, a nigga can't stop you because it's one round and you got the time that you got. And then in your mind, you're already telling yourself, yo, it's only one round. So you treat it differently from a third rounder, you know, from a psychological standpoint. You just treat it different. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I see. So, so you got, like, momentum, basically. Yeah, yeah. It's like a momentum thing. You, you got to think. In three rounds, your momentum gets stopped, depending on how, when you do what and where. You get what I'm saying? Your momentum stops or whatnot. You see, like, you see, like, like my third round against Suge. He wouldn't let me finish. You get what I'm saying? Remember, I was like, yo, let me just get this last eight out or let me just get these bars out. Or like when I battled Lux and I let Lux finish his whole third round, I was like, nah, keep going. But then when I tried to finish mine, they wouldn't let me finish. In a one rounder, it's like, nigga, I got this and this is what it is. And I'm going to get this all out. So it's momentum, pretty much. And then you don't, your momentum don't get fucked up because it's just you just straight ahead. It's like you hop on the highway, my nigga, and you just going straight, like for 20 minutes up the highway. And you ain't got to turn, get off at the exit until you get to the 20th minute, and then you get off the exit. So it's just straight. Then imagine having to get off here, turn right, turn left, get off here, do this. You get what I'm saying? That's the difference about it. Yo, yo, my nigga, yo. Always be a fan, my nigga. I, I don't care whether you battle, act. I'm always be a fan. My motherfucking you, nigga. nigga. My nigga. I appreciate you, bro. Anytime you see me at an event or anything, nigga, make sure you holler at me, boy. I appreciate you, my nigga. Word. Yo, Duff. Yo, Ash Cat. Add me on Christian Mingle. I holler at you. <laughs> <laughs> Why I gotta go on Christian Mingle? Ah!